The waterfront is an incredibly dangerous and unregulated workplace. Too often we've seen deaths on the waterfront in recent years and we've done everything we possibly can to turn that state of affairs around. We see complete deregulation, we see complete lack of attention to safety by employers on the waterfront and we've fought so hard over the last few years to make sure that we get a national stevedoring code of practice. In every workplace, in every branch of the union, wherever, the key priority for us and our membership is safety in the workplace. It is number one. I'm a big believer that uh, wages and conditions are, are important, but uh, first and foremost, that safety is the number one issue. The employer will always put wages in front of safety and, and a lot of guys will turn around and, and take that as a carrot and, and sell off other things. We've had fatalities which has touched the whole industry and um, we should be taking that back to the other ports and, um, and concentrating more on the safety value rather than always going for, for that dollar values. Employers continue to talk safety. We live their unsafe work practices and we're not going to cop their unsafe work practices anymore. We measure uh, ourselves as being successful if workers don't get injured, if workers don't die. We had a spate of deaths, particularly in the stevedoring industry, over the last six or seven years and we made a determination no more. We've determined to turn around the way safety has applied in the maritime industry in this country. We've determined to have a national set of obligations and a code of responsibility and a regulatory consistency in the stevedoring industry in particular that goes towards guaranteeing that fundamental human right. The right to go to work, the right to earn a living, the right to have respect and most importantly the right to go home at night to your family and your loved ones, the real reason you go for work in the first place. Yeah.